Hello everybody, welcome to lesson 5 of your English tutor. Today we will be talking about possessive adjectives. So what is a possessive adjective? A possessive adjective lets you know what something belongs to. For example, a pet, like this is my cat, my dog. These belong to me, it is mine. So we have many different possessive adjectives that we can use for each different word. For I, the possessive adjective is my. I, my, my cat. So we can write that here, my cat. So the word is my. For you, so that is you, you, your. That is your dog. So you with an R, your. Y O U R, your. That is your cat. Now, for he and she, we'll change it. We will say, for he, that is his cat. His, H I S, his cat. That is his cat. That is his fish. That is his horse. If it's a girl, we use she. It's not she's. That is she's cat. No. It is her. That is her cat. We spell that H-E-R. You don't always need to talk about animals with possessive adjectives. For example, you could say a ball or a car. That is her car or her shoe. For example, it is Things that we own. This is my house. House. If it is an it, for example, the cat, that is its ball. So the cat can own something too. So for it, we add an apostrophe and an S it becomes its. So I can write it here. Its. That is its ball. And for we, we, we use our. So if we are many people and we live in a house and that is our cat. It belongs to me and her and him, it belongs to us, so it is our cat. So, we is our, O-U-R, our. Finally, for they, they, a group of people that is outside of you, they becomes their, that is their cat. For example, if you go to a friend's house and they have a little cat or a dog, that is their cat or their baby. We will write it down here. T-H-E-I-R. So they changes we get rid of the Y and we add an I and an R. There. 
So write this down in your notebook so that you have these possessive adjectives. I'll give it a moment and I will flip the page. If you would like to pause the video, do so now. Now we will look at some examples of how to use a possessive adjective. The first example we have here is Joe. Joe is blank friend. So Joe is my friend. We can write this in here. Joe is my friend. He is my friend. Now, I am not an artist, as you can see, but here we see a woman and a dog. Scrappy, which is the dog's name, Scrappy is what? What do you think? The word is for a woman. Scrappy is a woman's dog. Scrappy is her dog. It belongs to her, the woman. So we use her, H-E-R. Scrappy is her dog. Easy. Now we have two people and a small child. He, which we are talking about this little child, he is for two people, for a group. He is their son, we can say, but if we are included, if I am with these two people, the, he is our son. If they are talking about their own child, if they are talking about him, he is our son. If we are on the outside and we see these two people, we can say that is their son. Now, notice I use the word that, that, T-H-A-T. -A -T. That is a determiner. We will look at this in the next page. There will be more practice of this in a worksheet. So, determiners. What is a determiner? A determiner is used to point out an object that you want to talk about. So, today we will learn two determiners. The first one is this. T-H-I-S. This. In English, the TH can be difficult sound to make for many English speakers. This, T-H-I-S, we use to talk about when there is not much space between the two objects. Here, we have a woman and a dog. Like I say, I'm not an artist, but a woman and her dog, notice they are very close together. And here is a big space. When there is not much space and they are close together, we use this. We can write this is her dog. This is her dog. 
we use this because they are close together. We can use that when there is a space between. That is her dog. That is her cat. When there is a space, we use that. When they are close, we use this. So I will write that is her, remember, because it is a girl, that is her dog. That is her dog. This is her dog. Now, of course, you don't have to only use this for dogs and that for dogs. You can use it for anything that you want to talk about to point out that is her, that is our, that is his. We can use any of our words from the first slide. This is my cat. That, with the space, is your cat. This is her cat. When you pick it up and you have a cat, this is my cat. And that will conclude the lesson on possessive adjectives and determiners. Good job, everybody, so far. Good luck on the worksheet, and I'll see you in.